Hello friends, welcome to Amazon Software Webcast and in today's video demonstration, we are going to see how to create user mailbox in Exchange 2016 by using GUI method. Recipients are the heart of Microsoft Exchange Server. There are different types of recipients in uh, Exchange 2016 and mailboxes are the one of mostly used in Exchange. After installing Exchange 2016, you can create a user mailbox which is one of the most commonly used mailbox type. So in this video, I will show you the steps to create user mailbox in Exchange 2016. But first of all, let's understand what is user mailbox. User mailbox is a mailbox that you assign to an individual user in your Exchange server organization. A user mailbox is a combination of user account and a mailbox. The user account is stored in Active Directory and is linked to a mailbox which is stored in database of your Exchange server. User mailbox are generally assigned to users. So users use these mailbox by logging into the email account to send and receive emails. So for this demonstration, we are going to create a user mailbox in our Exchange 2016. And to do that, you have to open Exchange Admin Center with the appropriate credential. And as you can see, already I open Exchange Admin Center with the credential of our administrator. And as you can see, by default, we have a one mailbox and that is the administrator. So when you install our exchange, that time administrator's mailbox will automatically created by the exchange itself. So let's see how we can create another user mailbox in our exchange. And then for that, you have to click on a plus sign. Here you can find the two options are there. First, user mailbox and second, link mailbox. So in this video, we'll just talking about the user mailbox. That's why I'm going to select user mailbox. There two options to create a user mailbox in Exchange 2016. You can create a mailbox for users that are already in Active Directory or you can create a new mailbox that will be eventually create an associated user account in your Active Directory. However, you create a user mailbox and Active Directory users account will be created and the associated mailbox will be created in Exchange Server. So for this demonstration, we are going to create a new user and that's why I'm going to select a new user. But first of all, we have to specify the alias. Now let's specify the name james.smith and you want to create a new user. That's why I'm going to give a name james and the last name will be smith and uh, this is the display name of a user james and the names will be james. You can also select the OU where you want to store this user account. So let's click on browse and we want to store this user account over built-in users container. Click on OK and let's specify the local name. Let's specify james.smith at mylab.local. This is the user's uh, login name and let's specify the password. You can also select this required password change on next login. But just for a demonstration, I'm not going to select this. And over here, you have a more options. Just click on it and under if you want to specify to store these users mailbox on a particular mailbox database that time you can click over there. Now let's click on browse and here we have a two mailbox database. One is MDB1 and second one is MDB02. Let's select MDB01. Click on OK. And if you want to select archiving that time you can select this box. But right now we are not going for archiving. That's why I'm not going to select any other options. Just click on save to create a user mailbox. And that's it. As you can see. Now we have a one mailbox for our user Jim Smith. And if you open uh, Active Directory Users and Computers, dsa.msc, under Active Directory Users and Computer, under Users Container, you can see there is our user name Jim Smith. And let's open this user account's mailbox by accessing the OVA, https colon double slash localhost slash OVA. There will be a certificate error. Click on advanced because we are right now using self-signed certificate and that's why proceed to localhost. And here we have to specify the user's name. Uh, let's specify james.smith at mylab.local and user password. Click on sign in. When you first time log into your mailbox, the, that time OA will ask you for select the language and time zone. And for this demonstration, let's select uh, English, English India and the time zone will be GMT plus 530. Okay, click on save. And as you can see, now our user name Jim Smith has his own mailbox. And right now, we do not have any mail, and that's why we can uh, see this. We didn't find anything to show here. Let's send one self mail. Let's specify the name James.smith at mylab.local. 
and uh, let's specify the subject test email hi click on send and here we go as you can see users receive a mail and it's from Jim Smith so this is the way how we can create a user mailbox in exchange 2016 and that's it for this demonstration thanks for watching this video